Welcome back to yet another Black Myth Wukong boss tutorial. Today we're going to be fighting the Elder Jinchi. This battle is quite difficult, but you've got one ace up your sleeve, and that is the zombies that are around them. If you kill them, they'll heal you. So basically, you've got unlimited heals almost. So we're going to go into the build again. It's pretty much the same as the last video, but just in case you haven't seen it already, so I'm going to walk through it again. So we're using the Pilgrim Armor for the when spinning. Each second moderately increases the attack. This effect can stack up to 10 times and will uh, cease upon stopping. So we're going to be using that a little bit in this one. Not too much, but we're going to give it a go anyway. And then obviously we're using the Wonder and White. Not a lot changed, to be honest. Not a lot changed at all. Uh, the stances, we've got one more that we can put in this again. Um, probably just do this. The Light Attack does temporarily more damage. We'll do that one. Um, stances, pretty much all the same. So we got the second focus point. Not in mysticism, not in transformations. We're going to go into the fight now anyway and just see what happens. Once again, I haven't done this fight since the first run through, so we're just gonna hope that we manage it. So we'll skip the cutscene if we can. Oh. There we go. Right, let's get in there. So he jumps at you first, I believe. So them zombies there, the things that can heal you. Okay, watch him. Watch him. Okay. So he does that same move as the, what's it called? The Wandering White. So we're gonna charge up the focus while we're running away. Big damage. Just like that. And he's hurt now. Watch it, watch your stamina, watch your stamina. Stay away, stay away. He does that three times, I think it is. There's the third one. Right there. And the fourth one, maybe. Yeah, so he does four. Okay, so we're going to charge that up again. And then we're going to get in there with a heavy attack as well. Get ready. Okay, so we hit us big time there. Just be careful. He does hurt. He does hurt. But this is good because now I can show you that if you kill these, that you get, he that you get healed. See? So you don't need to use your guard at all. So basically you got infinite heals right there. But just be careful because he can send them against you like he has now. So yeah, just be careful. And they can stack and it does hurt. So yeah. Try and get some heals off them again. There we go. Infinite heals. Charge this up. Charge it up while you sprint. Oh, hang on. Careful. Okay, so we had no stamina there. So you got to watch your stamina as well. Something I need to work on as well, chat. So, charge it up again. We haven't used anything yet. We haven't used anything. We haven't had to. Big damage. Get in there. Maybe we can use the mobilize. Why not? Bang! Keep going. Keep going. There's the second one. There's the second one. Watch his head. Watch his head. Big damage again. Big damage again. And now he's probably going to go up. and He's going to be invincible here. Now, this phase, you need to attack the zombies. Because if you don't attack the zombies, he's going to heal himself. So that's what we need to do here. We need to attack the zombies. So wherever they come from, just hit them. And he's definitely going to get one or two away. But if he does that, then it shouldn't be too bad. Because it doesn't heal them all that much, is what I'm trying to say. But yeah, just try and keep hitting them. And also, you're building focus up by doing this as well. So when he does come out of it, you've got a heavy ready for him. So just keep hitting him. Keep hitting all the zombies. It does last a little while, this as well. So, yeah, just be, just be wary of that. Okay, so there's loads coming now. So you're thinking that definitely there's going to be some that get absorbed. But if not, I don't think we've actually let them get one, you know. If you let them get too close, then he will, he will absorb them. Right, so now, get the heavy out. Oh, we missed, we missed. Well, you would get the heavy out because you're the better gamer than me. Right, we're going to hit him with a few light ones. And then we're going to hit him with his brother. There we go, Wandering White. There we go. And now he's stumbling. We're going to transform and get in there and just go all out. Absolutely all out. So hit the full focus. We're going to dodge and then use the heavy. And then get back in there. And again, we get two. We do, we get the heavy one as well. So there we go. That should be him. Finish. Just watch out for all these zombies. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Watch your, watch your stamina. Charge it back up. One. Two. Oh, we just missed it. We just missed it. That was a big damage as well. That was some big damage. So now we're going to use our goggles right at the end. Why the hell not? I'm just going to get in there and finish him off with the last few hits. We don't even need to think now, chat. We don't need even need to think. We just beat them. That's it. That is the end of Elder Jinchi. So yeah, again... Another rocky battle, but if you fight like this, it's so much fun as well. 
And you will get them. I promise you. I promise you. Let me know what you think of this one down below. Don't forget to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. And I'll see you in the next one.